Hey guys, so this will be a quick speed test between these two. We have the iPhone 10 or the iPhone X versus the Galaxy Note 8. This is the Snapdragon 835 variant. So I'm going to turn on both at the same time and see which one has the faster boot up. Let's go. Samsung versus Apple. It's your classic matchup here between the two titans of the cell phone world. We have the iPhone here booting up faster. Put my pattern in the Note 8. And we are in! There's nothing in the background. So let's get started with the phone app. Ooh, that was pretty much the same thing on both. Messaging. Tie again. Let's open the camera. Oh, maybe the iPhone by a split second. Let's open the calculator. And again, very close. Maybe that was another time. Let's open the clock on both. And not really sure. Maybe the iPhone by a half a split second. We have the Play Store and the App Store, respectively. Ooh, I'm going to click on this app. And I'm going to search for this app on the App Store. And I'll just leave it right there. eBay on both phones. And give this to the Note 8. I'm going to click on this. And I'll leave it right there. Amazon shopping. And let's see, Note 8 is faster on this one. We'll click on the deal of the day and I'll leave it on that page. Adobe Acrobat Reader. Note 8 on that one. Speed test app. And give that to the 10. Waiting for the Note 8. And we'll leave it there. Mario Run. Let's see, looks like the Note 8 is out in front here, but will the 10 catch up? No, it does not. Note 8 takes this game. Angry Birds 2. Let's see which one. Oh, we have the Note 8 here out in front, followed immediately by the 10. And the iPhone 10 opens this game a little bit faster, followed by the Note 8. We'll stop the game right there. Subway Surf. Let's see, both are loading. iPhone 10, a little bit faster. We'll stop the game right there. Temple Run 2. Let's see which one will be quicker here. Both are loading. And it looks like the iPhone's ahead a little bit. Followed immediately by the Note 8. Not that far behind, really. Going to play a little bit. And we'll stop the game right there. Grand Theft Auto, San Andreas. Let's go. Note 8 out in front. And I think the Note 8 will take this game. Yup. Give the win to the Note 8 on this one. CSR Racing 2. Let's see, hearing noise from the Note 8. And can the Note 8 beat the iPhone 10? No, it does not. iPhone 10 starting this game a little bit faster. Stop the game right there. Let's open Twitter on both. Give that to the Note 8. And Snapchat. Note 8 again. Let's take a look at the multitasking on both devices. Everything's in the background. We'll start with Twitter. Ready to tweet. Followed by CSR Racing. Ready to continue this game. Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Ready to play. Temple Run 2, ready to play also. Subway Surfers, ready to continue. Angry Birds 2, still in RAM. Super Mario Run, ready to play. The Speed Test app, slight delay on the iPhone. Adobe Acrobat Reader for your PDFs, ready to go on both phones. Amazon Shopping, right on that page eBay, right on that same item. The App Store and the Play Store, respectively, right on that Adobe Lightroom app. The clock on both, ready to take time. The calculator, ready to calculate. Camera, and a little bit of a stutter on the note. The messages, ready to text somebody, and I don't know if that was a refresh on the 10. 
And finally, we have the phone app ready to call somebody. Boom. So hit me up in the comments and let me know what you thought about this one as I clear all the apps on the iPhone. So let me know, are you an Apple iSheep? Are you down with the iPhone 10? First major redesign for this phone in like five million years? Or are you a Samsung Knight and you're down with this sexy design of the Note 8? Let me know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching. Peace out.